My name is Gary Murdoch, and I worked for the BC Forest Service for 35 years, 18 years on Vancouver Island. I retired in year 2000, just when this area was threatened to be logged. And so I came down here with some folks and had a look around. I looked at these Douglas firs. I thought, wow, those are old. And I know that this area was logged 100 years ago, but I think these trees, must, they must have left these trees for some strange reason. And they're so perfect. And, tall and straight and so I brought my inkman bore down and I drilled into the tree and took out a core sample and found out this tree is 80 years old. That was 18 years ago so now it's 98 and it's hard to figure out why they grow so tall and so big uh, in this area. Well it's not really hard to figure out why. I think probably part of the reason is this is very close to Little Qualicum River, a really good salmon spawning river. And since we've been walking in this area over the last 18 years, we find all kinds of salmon bones. We find signs of bears eating salmon. We find signs of cougars using this area. All kinds of wildlife and animals, eagles, lots and lots of eagles here, especially at salmon spawning time. Now, there are some big stumps in here too, but not that big. They're not really much bigger than this tree. And that was kind of puzzling too. And so we wondered, how did that happen? That these old, old stumps didn't get any bigger. Well, when you think about it, this is a floodplain. And just, to our, our, just beside me here is an old river channel. So obviously that river moved back and forth across the floodplain in different years. And it would take trees down and take them out to the ocean. And, new trees would grow. So what we're thinking now is some of these big stumps are maybe only a couple hundred years old. And the other thing that it could be is that there was a huge forest fire that pretty much wiped out the east side of Vancouver Island 300 years ago. So these stumps are maybe, you know, less than three, well, 200 years when they were cut down 100 years ago. They were maybe they were only 200 years old. So it does explain a lot about why the stumps aren't huge here. Because of the river, because of fires. These trees are growing so well, mainly because of the salmon. And then on the bank over here, the bank that drops off into the valley bottom is covered in springs where the water is weeping out. And it's covered in red alder, which are putting nitrogen into the soil. And the, the water is slowly moving it down to these Douglas firs. So they're very, very happy trees and very well-fed trees.